Hello, succulent enthusiasts! Welcome back to Forlit Sky Arts, Architecture, and Succulent Gardening Channel. Today, we're going to talk about something crucial for all succulent lovers common mistakes to avoid when caring for your precious plants. Caring for succulents can be easy, but people often make common mistakes. Avoiding these mistakes can help ensure the health and longevity of your succulents. Let's jump right in with the first mistake. Mistake number one is overwatering. Succulents are known for their ability to store water, and they don't like their roots to stay damp for too long. Succulents are adapted to survive in arid conditions and store water in their leaves and stems. Allow the soil to dry out completely between waterings, and be cautious not to let them sit in water-filled saucers. So avoid giving them too much love in the form of water. Let the soil dry out completely between watering to keep those roots healthy. Mistake number two is poor drainage. Succulent need well-draining soil to thrive. Using regular potting soil, all soil that retains too much moisture can lead to root rot. If your soil retains too much moisture, consider using a cactus or succulent mix or add some perlite or sand to improve drainage. And speaking of drainage, mistake number three is using a container without drainage holes. Without proper drainage, excess water can accumulate, which is a recipe for root rot. Always choose pots with holes at the bottom. Mistake number four, inadequate sunlight. Succulents love their sunshine. Rotate your succulents periodically to ensure even growth. Place them in bright indirect sunlight to keep them happy and avoid them getting leggy as they reach for light. Moving on to mistake number five, temperature neglect. Succulents have temperature preferences. Extreme cold or heat can harm your succulents. Protect them from frost and avoid exposing them to extreme temperatures. Mistake number six is overcrowding. Give your succulent enough space to grow. Overcrowding can lead to competition for light and resources, which can weaken the plants. Mistake number seven is neglecting pests. Keep an eye out for common pests like mealybugs and aphids. Regular inspection and prompt action are key. Mistake number eight is over-fertilizing. Succulents have relatively low fertilizer requirements. Over-fertilizing can lead to excessive growth and weak leggy plants. Use diluted balanced fertilizer and follow recommended application guidelines. Mistake number nine, inappropriate watering method. Watering succulents from above with a watering can or spray bottle can lead to moisture accumulating in the rosettes of some species, which can cause rot. Water at the base of the plant directly onto the soil. Mistake number 10, not repotting. As a succulent grows, they may become root-bound and not grow their containers. Repot them into slightly larger pots when they become crowded, usually every two to three years. And the 11th mistake is excessive handling. Succulents are sensitive to touch and excessive handling can damage their leaves. Avoid touching or handling them unnecessarily. Finally, mistake number 12, not acclimating to new conditions. When moving succulent to a different location with different light levels, temperature, or humidity, acclimate them gradually to prevent shock. There you have it folks, 12 common mistakes to avoid when caring for your succulents. Avoiding these common mistakes and providing the proper care can help your succulents thrive and stay healthy. Keep in mind that different succulent species may have slightly different care requirements, so it is a good idea to research the specific needs of your succulents for the best results. Thanks for tuning in today. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more gardening tips and tricks. Happy gardening and until next time.